What's up guys, Strax here. Today I'm going to be bringing you guys another top 5 male trucker beach outfit video. So the outfits that you do see in the thumbnail will be the outfits I'm going to show you how to make today. So we're going to go ahead and work on this first outfit that I'm wearing right here. So for this outfit, whenever you are at the clothing store, go ahead and just head over here to your tops. Whenever you do get to your tops, uh, if you guys want to go ahead and use, and if you guys want to just use a plain white t-shirt instead of this uh, smell like a bitch t-shirt, go ahead and scroll down until you do find t-shirts, which will be right here on slot 23. And you're going to want to go ahead and scroll down until you find the white t-shirt, which should be right here on slot 28. Whenever you do find the white t-shirt, you can use this t-shirt, but I'm going to be using another shirt that's on designer t-shirts. So if you guys don't want to use this shirt, go ahead and back out of the t-shirts and scroll down to designer t-shirts, which will be right here on slot 29. Click on designer t-shirts and you're going to be looking for the white smell like a bitch t-shirt. Whenever you have found the white bitch t-shirt, which is on slot 27, go ahead and equip to one of the shirts you want. You can either do the white t-shirt, which is on normal t-shirts, or you can go to the designer t-shirts and go to the white bitch t-shirt. After you find the t-shirt that you do like, you're going to want to go ahead and back out of your t-shirts or designer t-shirts and scroll down to the bottom on slot 53, which should be utility vest. Click on utility vest and scroll down until you do find the peach plate carrier, which will be right here on slot 43. Once you do find the peach plate carrier, you're going to want to go ahead and equip that utility vest. After you do equip that utility vest, you're now going to want to go ahead and back out of your tops, head over here to your pants. Whenever you do get to your pants, just click on jeans, which is on the first slot, and you're going to be looking for the black fitted, which is on slot 56. Once you have found the black fitted jeans, you can now back out of your pants, head over here to your accessories, scroll down to gloves, go ahead and click on gloves, and look for the black fingerless gloves, which are on slot 56. After you have found those gloves, you can now back out of your accessories, head over here to your shoes, scroll down to slip-ons, which will be on slot 12. After you click on slip-ons, you're going to be looking for the white canvas slip-ons, which will be on slot 9. After you've equipped those slip-on shoes, you can now back out of those shoes. And uh, that's pretty much it. So you can just now uh, take off any head accessories that your character has. So this is what your outfit should look like so far. So after your outfit looks like this, go ahead and go up to the front counter and just save this outfit on slot 1 or slot 20. After you have saved this outfit on slot 1 or slot 20, go ahead and back out of your edit saved outfits. Scroll down until you do find the heist coveralls, which will be on slot 13. So click on heist coveralls and scroll down to the bottom from slot 9 through slot 12 and select one of these outfits with the toxic mask. After you do select one of these outfits with the toxic mask, you're now going to want to go ahead and back out of the front counter and head to the pier so we can do the telescope glitch. When you do get to the pier and you find a telescope, you should be wearing this heist coverall. Now you're just going to want to go ahead and do the telescope glitch. So go ahead and run past the telescope, hit right on the d-pad. You should see that your character glitches or his mask does come off. Pull up your interaction menu, scroll down to style, click on style, and scroll down to your outfit and go ahead and select the outfit you just saved on slot 1 or slot 20. After you do equip that outfit, walk away from the telescope and you should see that the mask does combine with the outfit just like this. Now, after the, uh, after the mask does combine with the outfit, after you get to the gun store, go ahead and walk over here to the clothing section, and you're just going to want to go ahead and hit edit saved outfits and save this outfit again on slot 1 or slot 20. Once you do save the outfit on slot 1 or slot 20, go ahead and back out, and now you're going to want to go and start the job that's called a titan of a job. So go ahead and hit pause, scroll to online, click online. Click on jobs, scroll down to play G or scroll down to play jobs and scroll down to rush rockstar created, scroll down to missions, click on missions, scroll down to a titan of a job, and just fully start up that job. When you load into the Titan of a Job, you should see that you guys are wearing your outfit, but without the peach plate carrier. So it should only be your outfit with the toxic mask. So after your outfit looks like this, go ahead and go back over here to your tops. Hit edit saved outfits and save this outfit again on slot 1 or slot 20. Once you have saved the outfit on slot 1 or slot 20, you can now back. Now you can just back out, pull up your phone, and just leave, leave the job from your phone. 
Once you have loaded back into a public session, go ahead and run back inside the gun store. Walk over here to your tops. Walk over here on the right. You guys will see it says outfits. If you walk over here on the left, it should say tops. So go over here to your tops, hit right on the D-pad, scroll down to vests, which is on slot 47, click on vest and scroll down and you can just go and put on any vest that looks like this. After you put on a vest, go ahead and back out of your vest, scroll down to vest shirts, which is on slot 48, click on vest shirts and you're gonna to wanna to go ahead and equip the white band of vest shirt, which is on slot 10. Once you do equip the white band of vest shirt, you're now gonna to wanna to go ahead and back out, of the, back out of your tops. And for the merge glitch, you're gonna to wanna to go ahead and just head to your apartment. Whenever you do get to your apartment, go ahead and go to your heist planning board room. After you get to your heist planning board room, go ahead and go up to your heist planning board. After you are here up at your heist planning board, you should see where it shows all the heist out of the five, go ahead and select the one that says the flake of job. After you do find the, after you do select the one that says the flake of job, the first job it's gonna have you do, it's gonna be called scope out. After you've completed the scope out mission, the second job it's gonna have you do, it's gonna be called Karuma. And that's gonna be the job that we're gonna be using for the merge glitch. So once you have the Karuma job ready, just start up that job. When you have loaded into the Kuruma job, make sure your heist clothing is set to player saved outfits. After your heist clothing is set to player saved outfits, you can confirm your settings and then you can just wait for a random or your friend to join and then you can just launch the job. When you load into here where your owned outfits are, you're, if you did save your outfit on slot 1, scroll one time to the right. If you saved your outfit on slot 20, scroll one time to the left. And for some reason, I guess the logo doesn't transfer over for some reason. But after your outfit looks like this, then you can just hit ready to play. Once you have loaded into the Karuma job, you can now just pull up your phone and just leave the job from your phone. Once you have loaded back into a public session, you're going to want to go ahead and find a vehicle. It doesn't matter if it's your personal vehicle or a civilian car on the street. After you do have a car, go ahead and hop inside that vehicle. After you get inside that vehicle, pull up your interaction menu and join a CEO or a motorcycle club. After you join a CEO or a motorcycle club, pull up your interaction menu, click on Secure Serve CEO or Motorcycle Club, and then scroll down to Management, scroll down to Style, and on your CEO style or MC style, go ahead and scroll one time to the left, and then scroll one time to the right back to None. After it's set back to None, hop out of the car, and then you should see that it should be your uh, ripped shirt and your outfit uh, that looks like this. So after your outfit looks like this, now you're going to want to go ahead and head to the clothing store so we can finish this outfit. When you are at the clothing store, for me, uh, this is what I put on this outfit. Go ahead and walk over here to the hats. Scroll down to bulletproof helmets, which is on slot 19. Click on bulletproof helmets. Scroll down to the bottom and equip the black bulletproof. After you do equip the black bulletproof, go ahead and back out, walk over here to the glasses, scroll down to casual glasses, click on casual glasses, and look for the black casuals, which should be right here on slot 13. So go ahead and equip the black casuals. After you do that, that's all I put for this outfit. So now you can just go ahead and go up to the front counter, hit edit saved outfits, and you're going to want to go ahead and just save this outfit on whichever slot you want. So yeah, after, after you're done with this outfit, we can now move on to the second outfit. This will be the second outfit I'm going to show you how to make. So for this outfit, go ahead and walk over here to your tops. Whenever you are here at your tops, you scroll down until you do find a track jackets, which will be right here on slot 16. Click on track jackets, and you're going to be looking for the tan tracksuit top, which will be right here on slot 30. After you do equip this track jacket, you're going to want to go ahead and back out of your tops. Head over here to your pants. Whenever you are here at the pants, click on jeans, which is on slot 1 and you're gonna be looking for the Midnight Camo Fitted, which is on slot 41. After you have equipped the uh, Midnight Camo Fitted jeans, back out of your pants, head over here to your accessories. After you are here at the accessories, scroll down to gloves, click on gloves, and you're gonna be looking for the white cotton gloves, which are on slot 53. After you do equip the white cotton gloves, back out of your accessories, walk over here to your shoes, scroll down to skate shoes, which is on slot three, and you're, and you're gonna be looking for the tan skate shoes, which will be on slot 14. After you do find the tan skate shoes, back out of your shoes, head over here to the hats, scroll down to bulletproof helmets, which is on slot 19, 
click on bulletproof helmets and look for the tan bulletproof after you have found the tan bulletproof helmet you're not going to want to go ahead and back out of your hats and for this outfit to finish the rest of this outfit just head to the mask store so when you are at the mask store just walk over here to the mask scroll down to ski mask which is on slot 19 click on ski mask and you're going to be looking for the charcoal toggle ski which is on slot 94. after you found the charcoal toggle ski go ahead and equip that mask after you have equipped that mask your bulletproof helmet will disappear so now you're just going to want to go ahead head over here to the pier so we can do the telescope glitch so we can, can so we can merge the mask with the helmet when you do get to the telescope just do the telescope glitch so go ahead and run past the telescope like this hit right on the d-pad you should see that your character glitches where his mask does come off pull up your interaction menu scroll down to style scroll down to accessories and scroll down to your helmets and scroll through your helmets until you do find the tan bulletproof once you do find the tan bulletproof helmet put away your interaction menu walk away from the telescope and you should see that the mask does merge with your helmet just like this and this is what your outfit will look like whenever you're done so now you can just go ahead go to the clothing store save this outfit on whichever slot you want and yeah now we can just go ahead and move on to the third outfit Okay guys, whenever you are back at the clothing store, this will be the third outfit I'm going to show you how to make. For this outfit, head over here back to your tops. Whenever you are here at your tops, scroll down until you do find sweaters. Sweaters should be right here on slot 39, so go ahead and click on sweaters once you are here. And scroll down until you do find the beige turtleneck, which will be on slot 67. After you do find the beige turtleneck, the beige turtleneck go ahead and equip it on your character. After you have done that, back out of your tops. Head over here to your pants. Whenever you do get to your pants, scroll down to suit pants, which will be on slot six. Click on suit pants, and you're gonna be looking for the cream slim fit, which is on slot 18. After you do equip the cream slim fit suit pants, you can now back out of your pants. Head over here to your accessories. Scroll down to necklaces. Go ahead and click on necklaces and uh, equip the bottom one, which should be called the black bead necklace. After you do equip the black bead necklace, back out of the necklaces scroll down to gloves go ahead and click on gloves and scroll down to slot 62 which will be the black driving gloves once you do equip the black driving gloves and you guys have the necklace you can just back out of your accessories head over here to your shoes scroll down to skate shoes which is on slot 3 click on skate shoes and you're going to be looking for the two-tone skate shoes which is on slot 17 and after you have equipped those skate shoes back out of the shoes head over here or before we actually do get to the hats, go ahead and pull up your interaction menu, scroll down to style, scroll down to accessories, and if you guys do own the rebreather, whenever you are hovering over gear, hit right on your d-pad once and it should be the rebreather. If you for some reason don't own the rebreather, go ahead and go up to the gun store, and whenever you do get to the gun store, go to the middle counter where it says gear, and you should see uh it should show the earpieces like three earpieces night vision goggles and then at the bottom it'll say rebreather go ahead and buy the rebreather and after you do buy the rebreather then after you have it equipped on your character you can go over here to your hats and scroll down to bulletproof helmets which is on slot 19 and scroll down to the tan bulletproof and just equip the tan bulletproof just like that and yeah, this is what your outfit will look like whenever you're done. So now you can just go over here, go up to the front counter, save this outfit on whichever slot you want. And now we're going to go ahead and move on to the fourth outfit. This will be the fourth outfit I'm going to show you how to make. For this outfit, head back over here to your tops once again. Whenever you do get to your tops, scroll down until you do find shirts. And shirts should be right here on slot 30. So just click on shirts. And you're going to want to go ahead and scroll down to slot 86, which should be the gray check shirt that looks like this. After you do equip the gray check shirt, back out of your tops, head over here to your pants. And whenever you do get to the pants, just click on jeans, which is on the first slot. And look for the light blue fitted, which will be on slot 35. And after you do equip the light blue fitted jeans, back out of the pants, head over here to your accessories, scroll down to gloves. Whenever you do find gloves, go ahead and click on gloves, and you're going to be looking for the white cotton gloves, which will be on slot 53. After you do equip the white cotton gloves, go ahead and back out of your accessories, head over here to your shoes, scroll down to sports shoes, which will be on slot 9, click on sports shoes, 
and you're gonna wanna go ahead and scroll down to the all white sports shoes, which will be on slot 28. Once you do find the all white sports shoes, go ahead and equip those shoes on your character. Then you can back out, head over here to your hats, scroll down to bulletproof helmets, which is on slot 19, and just equip the tan bulletproof. And after you do equip the tan bulletproof, back out of the hats, head over here to your glasses. Whenever you are here at the glasses, scroll down to casual glasses, click on casual glasses, and you're gonna to wanna to go ahead and scroll down to slot 22 and buy the white still shades. After you do buy the white still shades, you can now just back out of the glasses. And for this outfit, you will wanna to head to the mask store. Once you are here at the mask store, just walk over here to the mask, scroll down to ski mask, which is on slot 19. After you click on ski mask, go ahead and scroll down to slot 106, and it should be the blue tight ski. After you do find the blue tight ski, your bulletproof helmet and mask should combine together. So now you're going to want to go ahead and head to the pier so we can do the telescope glitch so then we can combine the glasses with the mask and helmet. Whenever you have found a telescope on the pier, you're just going to want to go into the telescope glitch. So go ahead and run past the telescope, hit right on the d-pad. You should see that your character's mask and helmet do come off. Pull up your interaction menu, scroll down to style, scroll down to accessories, and scroll down to your glasses and scroll through your glasses until you do find the white still shades. Whenever you do find the white still shades, you can then put away your interaction menu and walk away from the telescope. Once you have walked away from the telescope, you should see that the glasses do combine with the mask and helmet just like this. And this is what your outfit will look like whenever you're done. So now you can just go ahead, go to the clothing store, save this outfit on whichever slot you want. And yeah, now we're gonna go ahead and move on to the fifth outfit. So this will be the final outfit I'm going to show you on how to make in today's video. So for this outfit, whenever you are back at the clothing store, head over here to your tops. Whenever you are here at your tops, scroll down to t-shirts, which will be right here on slot 23. Click on t-shirts and you're going to want to go ahead and scroll down to slot 28, which should be the white t-shirt, like I said, on slot 28. So once you have equipped the white t-shirt, back out of your tops, head over here to your pants. Whenever you do get to your pants, scroll down to suit pants, which will be on slot six, click on suit pants, and you're gonna be looking for the white slim fit, which will be on slot 24. After you do equip the white slim fit, back out of your pants, head over here to your accessories, scroll down to cuffs, click on cuffs, and for your left arm, you're gonna be buying the spiked gauntlet, which will be on slot six. And if you scroll down to slot 17, it should be the spiked gauntlet for your right arm. And after you do have those gauntlets for your left and right arm, go ahead and back out of your cuffs, scroll up to gloves, go ahead and click on gloves, and just equip the black fingerless gloves, which will be on slot 56. And after you have those gloves, the black fingerless gloves, you can now back out of your accessories, head over here to your shoes, and you can go ahead and click on any selections of shoes that doesn't matter. And at the top, it should be no shoes. You're gonna wanna go ahead and set it to no shoes, which will be on slot one. After your character has no shoes, back out of the shoes, head over here to the hats, scroll down to bulletproof helmets, which will be on slot 19, and just equip the black bulletproof. After you have done that, then you can just back out of the hats, head over here to your glasses, scroll down to casual glasses, click on casual glasses, and you're gonna be, and you're gonna be looking for the black casuals, which will be on slot 13. After you do have the black casuals equipped on your character, you can back out of the glasses, and that's pretty much it. Oh, and I did forget the body armor. So pull up your interaction menu, scroll down to inventory, scroll down to body armor, scroll down to show armor, and make sure you do set it to your standard armor, which is this black bulletproof vest that looks like this. And now this is what your outfit will look like whenever you're done. So now you can just go ahead, go up to the front counter and save this outfit on whichever slot you want. So I hope you guys did enjoy these five uh, male charred beach outfits. I hope you guys did enjoy. Please like and subscribe. Thank you guys for watching. Peace.